This is Jaipur, the city planned by Jai Singh, its 18th century ruler, to represent Navagraha, the mandala of the nine planets. Because of a hill, one of the squares got moved to the other side. And the wonderful thing about Jaipur is that Jai Singh, who was the ruler who built it, had these two takes on the sky. One was the oldest myths of the nine planets, Naugraha. The other was the newest myths of science, which had just started in uh, measuring, trying to measure the sun and the moon, but through instruments which were not movable because that, that spoils the whole accuracy. These are huge values which science brought and he'd combine them both in the city. And I thought that's wonderful because he was really looking backward and forward in one gesture. Jai Singh was a truly extraordinary man. In a certain sense, perhaps he was the first modern Indian and a precursor of Nehru, who also, when we became an independent nation in 1947, tried to rediscover India's past while simultaneously opening a door to a brand new future. So when Korea was asked to design this art center in Jaipur in memory of Jawaharlal Nehru, he designed a contemporary building that was based on the same Navagraha, connecting past and present in one integrated gesture in honor of Nehru and of Jai Singh. The brief prepared by the state government listed a number of items, like art galleries, exhibition halls, craft workshops, theaters, and so forth. Korea took these requirements and ingeniously assigned each one of them to the appropriate planet. One of the squares is moved, recalling the gesture of Jai Singh that created the plan of Jaipur. And we find again the pathway that moves through it all, sometimes open to sky and sometimes under cover. So here you have the nine planets and one of them is moved to the right, and uh, that gives the public access to Mangal, which is the, for the administration, Guru, the library, and Shukra, where the theatres are. That movement gave me access to the mandala. So, we enter here. This is where the administration is, Mangal, the planet of power. On this dome, Rajasthan's traditional artists have depicted a giant cosmograph representing the entire manifest world. Every tree, every fish, every animal, every mountain. Similarly, each one of the other nine planets has its own unique plan and form, illustrating the traditional qualities of that planet, including its auspicious colors. In the center is the ninth square, an open to sky amphitheater. This is crucial, for when you move around through the other squares, you sense your orientation through the glimpses you get of this empty center. On the red sandstone walls of each planet is inlaid its traditional symbol in white marble and black kadapa stone. 